I know a lot of my audience wasn't even born yet when the O.J. Simpson trial concluded. I was taking a deposition on the top floor of the Vincent and Elkins offices in Houston when everything stopped and the televisions came on in the conference room and everyone was holding their breath, waiting to see if the jury was going to find him guilty or not guilty. And everyone was shocked when they found him not guilty because the whole world knew he was guilty. But the jurors, even though some of the jurors admitted they thought he was guilty, they said that there was some reasonable doubt. And because they doubted some, they felt they couldn't find him guilty beyond a reasonable doubt. But then later there were civil trials where the preponderance of the evidence is the standard, which is not as high as beyond a reasonable doubt. And at those trials, they found that he was responsible for the death of his wife and owed money for it. The problem was they couldn't collect the money because his money was all tied up in trusts.